Welcome everyone to our second post-match press conference from the 2016 NCAA Central Region Volleyball Tournament. I'm joined now by the number three seeded University of Nebraska Kearney, who ends our season with a record of 35 and two after falling to number six seed Augustana University. We are joined today by head coach Rick Squires, senior outside hitter Annie Wolf, and junior middle blocker Tara Ziegelbein. We'll begin with a statement from the head coach and then open up for questions. Um, first of all, I, I would like to congratulate Augustana on a well-played match. Um, fought hard, made a few plays down the stretch when they needed to. They have a very nice team, competed well, and, uh, you know, it, it was, other than coming up short, it, it was a fun match to be a part of because the level of play was, was very good. Um, so pertaining, uh, to the match, um, you know, we're proud of the way our team played, and uh, we had some really good individual performances, and our, our team fought all the way through and, you know, represented us extremely well, so we, we couldn't be prouder of the group we came up here with and how they conducted themselves and the season that we've had. Um, again, it's very unfortunate that top 10 teams play each other in the first round of the NCAA tournament. Uh, it's unfortunate that we're the sole representative of the great MIAA conference. Uh, so, you know, in some ways, the fact that we were even in the game with a mighty Northern Sun team was, you know, very satisfying because, uh, you know, we, we have been deemed the inferior conference, obviously. So couldn't be prouder of our kids for how they fought. And uh, maybe one day we won't have to come up here and play the real national tournament in a regional site. So there you have it. We'll now open up for questions. Well, Rick, it's really fun to watch the match today. And your kids seem to get looser and more excited as the match goes on. What was the key to making that happen? That's how they are. Uh, that's why they've been so much fun this year. And they are a tremendous group of people. And that's been from day one. <coughs> going all the way back to last spring. Um, they're one of the most fun groups I've ever been around. So that, that's what makes it uh, you know, more disappointing for it to come to an end, is that uh, this group did it the right way uh, every day, every practice, every game. And uh, everything that they earned this year, they deserved. And uh, so, you know, it's how we've played all year. We've had a, you know, a few other matches here late in the season where we've had to kind of battle from behind and things like that. And they're just warriors and competitors, and they believe in each other. And geez, you get that, you get a group like that to coach, and that's that's the fun stuff right there. Now, Tara, you were feeling that slide today. Yeah, I guess so. Um, I got to give a lot of credit to our back row. Our defense was fantastic today, and. The reason that I was put in that position is because we got balls up and Lindsay was given great balls, so I needed to do my job. And That's a very nice statement, but doesn't it take a little bit of confidence to run up and swing the seat Yeah, I go up there with confidence. Yeah, I came into the game very confident, very confident in myself, very confident in my teammates. And yeah, just went up there and just banged at it, I guess. <laughs> and it worked out well. Yeah. And oh boy. <laughs> um, you don't often see players that can play the whole game. It seemed to be a real tribute to the, not only to you, but to the coaches in your conference that they were able to select someone that can do so many things so well. So often you see the, best, the biggest stat wins the most valuable whatever award. Uh, and watching you play today and watching your growth over the last year, um, you played the whole game. <laughs> yeah, I'm a little tired, but um, <laughs> um, yeah, I love playing both front row and back row. And I mean, I came in as a freshman and I was only a back row player. So I really kind of developed those skills my um, first two years here. And then I was put in the position to hit last year and kind of embraced that and went back to what I did best my freshman year and just put it all together, just played the whole game. I've had the good fortune of coaching lots of fine setters and some of the balls that you, that you set today. <laughs> Don't tell her that. <laughs> oh she never put me in. She never would let me in. Yeah. Um, 
me set, so I just had to find other ways to set. <laughs> <laughs> so yeah. Congratulations on a final season. Thank what are you, you looking forward to as a senior? What was that? What are you looking forward to now that you're done? Well, um, graduating definitely is on number one on the list. <laughs> so got to pass my classes. And um, just to be able to come back, my little sister's coming to play next year, so I'm super excited for her just to experience the coaching and the team and it's going to be hard to watch, but I'm, I'm ready to move on, I think. I left it all out there. All right. Thank you, everyone, and congratulations on a fantastic season. Thank you. Thank you. You're the best, Tom.